Hello BTBDs, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be testing out the brand new Halo Taco nail polish, okay? So Chris actually got this for me in the mail. I had no idea it had even come out and he was just like, you know what? The internet is going crazy over this so I'm getting it for you and I was like, okay. So he got me three different nail polishes. This one has been out for a little while. It's called Play Rosé. I'm going to be putting this on my feet today, but then the star of the show is this brand new Aurora Unicorn Skin Nail Polish. This is freaking insane. It is so cool. And then he got me this nail polish in the shade Indigo Away for a base and then to add this on top. I'm going to be testing out these nail polishes today. So if you enjoy videos like this, let me know by giving this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe because I do upload every Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 5 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. I just want to show you guys like how freaking cool this nail polish is. It is so cool. It's got like these really cool like specks of glitter and purple and green and blue. It's just so cool. It does look like unicorn skin. So I'm excited to test this out. All right, you guys, I cannot wait to use these. These are so cool. So I am going to be focusing on these two today and then adding this Essie gel on top. First, I'm going to take this shade called Indigo Away. It's a gorgeous purple. First off, this packaging is awesome. It's got like a matte black lid. So pretty. Ooh, this is a really nice wand. Last time I did this video, Chris did it for me, so you're gonna see how I do nail polish. It's not very good. If you guys don't know, Halo Taco is a YouTuber who does really awesome, cool videos. This is a gorgeous shade. Oh my gosh, I would just wear this on its own. You guys did not see the video where Chris did my nail polish. I will link it for you guys. It was quite entertaining and he did such a good job. He was so proud of himself. So I think I'm going to, oh, this is just too close to me. I think I'm going to just add a layer this on first and then I'm going to add the unicorn skin on top. Now my understanding is this is supposed to be a topper. I feel like ever since we've been quarantined and at home and stuff, I've gotten more into skincare and like self-care in general. I've been spending a lot of time doing like masks and more like this kind of stuff that I wouldn't normally have time for. Now I am not a professional nail polisher. It's just not my life. So I apologize if you're offended by my lack of coordination with this. But you know what? I can't go get my nails done. So just for fun. So I'm going to do them myself. Let's see about this hand. I am a righty. So my left hand really struggles when I do my nail polish. Actually, I guess with my left hand putting on the nail polish, my left hand looks really nice because my right hand applied the polish, but my right hand, you guys, it's often doesn't look great. So pretty, so opaque. This is such a cool color. Every time I do my nails, I wish I did my nails more often. Oopsie, look. Okay, that one doesn't look great, but we're moving on. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. Oh no, you guys. Good thing this is the bottom layer. I accidentally touched my wet nail polish to the actual like container, the bottle of nail polish. Whoops. All right, that wasn't too bad, you guys. Not too shabby. I think I am gonna do another coat just cause that's normally what I do. Oh my God, I totally royally screwed this up. I'm gonna do a second coat just to make sure that this is good and the way that I would normally do my nails, but this is what it looks like so far. I'm super excited to use this one on my toenails, but I'm weird about my feet, so I'm not gonna be showing you guys that. Um, but this looks like such a cool shade also. I am also notorious for thinking that my nails are dry and then I can go do like regular life things, but then they totally are not. I'm gonna force myself to sit here, just let them dry. I already kind of did this a second time and now I'm ruining it. Ugh. Okay, moving on from that one. That was the one that I accidentally touched with the bottle when it was still wet. Looks about the same. I mean, when I shower and stuff, it's all of this is gonna come, or on my skin, all this is gonna come off. So it'll look nice once I shower, but I already showered today. I also hate going to all this effort for putting like polish on my nails for it to chip right away so annoying. So that's part of the reason why I don't do my nails that often. Carefully. 
you can just let them dry but here's what it looks like before I go in with this unicorn skin I'm gonna let these dry and then we will get to putting on this pretty super cool unicorn skin topper I'm back I actually just painted my toenails with this this is a freaking cool color okay I'm just gonna show you just because like look at that that is so cool if you don't like feet that's fine but look at that color that is just so cool moving on now we get to testing out to this unicorn skin I'm so pumped for this I know that my nail polish is not all the way dry but oh no I should have opened this one my oh gosh okay let's just do a layer Ooh. oh my god now this is cool I feel so cool right now with this on my nails that is fascinating oh my gosh this is the coolest nail polish I've ever tried ever I feel now like I am a unicorn. It's so sticky though, like it's so glittery and sticky, this formula, so I love it. <laughs> I'm gonna put this on top of everything that I own. I like that it's not this like chunky glitter, it's kind of like this gooey, gloopy top coat that sinks the like glitters and stuff into your already nail polish. So it's not like sticking up on my nail. It's not gonna be super hard or grainy. I love this. This is what I'm gonna do over quarantine, just this on everything. All right, this is my hand with it on compared to with it off. It totally takes your nail polish to the next level. It's so pretty. It's so purpley and sparkly and just beautiful. I'm in love. I'm not gonna do two coats of this because I feel like if I did, it would just look so bad. Like it just would be too gloppy and gloopy and stuff. So that is a word of warning. Like this is for sure. I feel like it's very thick and sticky. Wow. What is in this stuff? And it, you really need to put this underneath the light for it to shine. Like if I just normally looked at it, I mean, oh my God, it looks so cool. Ooh, okay, I can see blue, I can see green, I can see every color. Hopefully this doesn't like sell out. Maybe it already has sold out, I don't know. Whatever is in this is magic. Like I said, it just, it can get a little gloopy gloppy if you put too much on. Maybe I'll just have nails like this the whole time I'm in quarantine. Like, oh yeah, still in quarantine, but look, my nails look like unicorn skin. Like you don't even really see it until it's on your nails. Like it looks so clear, but then when it's under the light, it is so fascinating. This has purple, pink, blue, oh my goodness. Here's what it looks like on the nails, so cool. I do feel ethereal right now. <laughs> I'm gonna let this dry and then put on a top coat. This is the finished product. I just added a top coat. So this is the Essie Gel. If you guys have a better top coat, please let me know. I would love a top coat that helps keep my nail polish on my nails longer. But here is the final result. This stuff is freaking awesome. If you have the chance to pick it up, it just takes your nail polish to a whole nother level. I feel like I am in a fairy tale land when I look at my nails. So highly recommend if you can get your hands on it. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.